Congratulations on being on, uh, it, I, it is probably one of my favorite shows in a long, long time. Wow. It is just so funny, so well written in all of the characters. You must be loving it. Yeah, it's been, it's been crazy. It's been the craziest thing that's happened in my life to this point. I mean, I was, you know, acting for a while, but never really getting, I guess, recognized like this, which mm -hmm. now seems like a hallucination when I walk down the street. You, if you're not used to it, when you're walking down the street and people that normally walk by you all of a sudden, they're like, hello, <laughs> how are you? And you're like, oh my goodness. <laughs> the weirdest one was actually in New York. Um, my wife and I were uh, in Central Park and we were walking through a tunnel. And at the end of the tunnel was a guy who looked pretty much homeless. He was, and he was playing a, a fiddle with like two strings on it, and he was making no. It was like ring, 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 ring. It's pretty good for two yeah, strings. Yeah, I mean, really yeah. nice. Yeah, really nice. Nice work. And as I got towards the end of the tunnel, he goes ring, 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 ring. Not since Frasier has a show come on the air knowing its tone so completely. <laughs> and I, I was like, I'm sorry, figment of my imagination. What did you say? Wow. Yeah. That's amazing. He had a detailed, complete analysis of the show. <laughs> Better than a lot of critics. Yeah, like, that's oh, yeah. really amazing. Yeah. And then, and then the show just went to Hawaii. The, the, or did you go to Hawaii? The show? The show went to Hawaii. I also went with, with the, the show? show to I Hawaii. See. Yeah. Um, which was it was it was really fun. I think it may be the least uh, intense performances by a cast ever because uh -huh. we were all extremely relaxed. And my, uh, my wife and I actually got a couple's massage, which we thought would be incredibly romantic, but I have horrible hearing. And so during the massage, the, the masseuse was, would, to be considerate of my wife, who was in the room, would kind of go like, would you like to go now? <laughs> That's what it sounded like to me. Right. And I would go, I'm sorry, what? I don't, I can't. I, <laughs> and then she'd go, I, would you like to? And I was like, I'm, I can't. And then my wife would go, she'd like to roll you over. <laughs> and this went on and on and on throughout the massage. Is, is that enough on your feet? <laughs> and then when we left, I was like, that just felt amazing. And she was like, great time, great times in there. Yeah. Oh, that's horrible. Yeah. A and you, your wife, uh, you both, you lived in New York uh, up until this show, is that right? Yes, we did. She's from New York as well? Uh, well she, we're, neither one of us are from New York. We went there uh, to kind of make our way. Uh-huh. Um, and... Uh, to make your way? Yeah. So, so you're in New York and then you, you, you moved here. Yeah, we moved here, um, uh, I mean, kind of on and off over the last few years, but we've moved here now, which has been, it's been really nice. I mean, there's, there's nothing to complain about. We just, we miss the walking primarily. We're, we're just used to like walking everywhere. And out here, mm. I, no. No, we don't walk. No, 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 <laughs> no. Uh -uh. You're, you're looking at me like we don't like your kind. No. <laughs> No, we understand your kind, but <laughs> but we really don't walk here. Yeah. Where do you do you live in an area that there? I, I do. I I live. I moved close enough to Fox so that I could. I mean, to the studio where I could actually walk. You walk to, to work. I walk to work. It's the craziest thing I've ever heard. Yes, <laughs> and you're not the only one. I have people from work pulling over, essentially every day, asking what happened. <laughs> you know, like what's going on? Where uh, is is everybody okay? And where, where's your car? And then, you know, I get, I have to kind of like, once I get through all those folks, I get to neighborhoods where there are no sidewalks because they are discouraging walking. So I'm either a creepy guy on somebody's lawn <laughs> or I'm out dodging traffic and yeah. people like, you know, hitting, you know, locking their doors. It's true. There are some neighborhoods that we don't even have sidewalks that you yeah. can't even, I try to walk my dog and you're kind of going, like, there's... People are like, no, <laughs> no, get out of our neighborhood. <laughs> And um, just, just quickly, because I, I just heard this also, you lived in your car for a short time. Is that... I did. Is that before you moved to New York? It, it was. I was in grad school, and I lived in my van to save money, and not surprisingly, didn't date any women. No. During that period. No. They did. no. Would you like to come back to my van? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Allow me to slip into my van pajamas. <laughs> With a pipe in and your van. Yeah, right. Ah, wonderful. Don't mind the extra tire. Yeah. yeah. Well, look at you now.